Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Y'all trying to figure out what to do with your ground meat besides spaghetti, meatloaf, the regular ground beef meals? Keep watching, cause we about to turn it up. We about to turn it up a notch. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more great cooking videos. Let's jump right into it. As you can see, you need your bell peppers and onions and your garlic. You wanna go ahead and chop those up. We want to give that a saute. I'm not going to cook these veggies too long. I just want to kind of soften them up just a little bit, pull some of that flavor out of them. And now we're going to add in our ground meat. I'm using ground turkey, but of course you can use ground beef, ground chicken, whatever ground meat that you like. It doesn't matter. This recipe is so good. You're going to love it and your family's going to love it too. It's so funny because when I first made this meal for my daughter, she had a boyfriend with her and he didn't want any, you know, he was like, I'll pass, you know, ground meat, uh, uh, I don't know about this one. So she's, as she was eating her meal, she let him taste it. He wouldn't even give her the plate back. <laughs> I'm telling you, it is, this, this ground meal is so delicious. You put this over a bed of white rice. I'm telling you, you cannot go wrong. You can't go wrong. So now we're gonna go ahead and season this. I use my tropical sazon seasoning. You guys already know this is one of my favorite seasonings. If you haven't tried it, I recommend you give it a try. And now we're gonna add in some onion powder. Make sure to season it good. You know, get in there with that seasoning so the flavors can really pop. Next, you wanna add in this beef bouillon seasoning. This is a seasoning. It's like a bouillon cube, but it's actually a seasoning. If you have not tried it, give it a try. I really love to use this in my recipes. If I use a uh, ground turkey, I like to use the beef just to you know enhance the flavors a little bit. Now just mix everything together. We just wanna brown the meat. We don't wanna overcook the meat. We just wanna give it a good, nice little brown on it, and we should be good to go. Is this your first time making this ground meat recipe? If so, let me know what you think about this recipe. Okay, some stuff trying to leave the pan. Stay in the pan. We need every last bit of this goodness. <laughs> it's just that serious, guys. It's just that serious. Now we wanna add in some minced garlic. I like to add minced garlic as well as Gar chopped garlic because I just like garlic <laughs> and I love the flavor profile that it brings to this dish and just for a little bit of heat I'm gonna add in a scotch bonnet pepper this is just my choice I just want that heat factor but you could totally do without it and this meal will still be the bomb okay okay <laughs> next we want to add in our fresh tomatoes use like a medium size really ripe tomato to get the best results Next, we're gonna add in just a little bit of water. Because I added in the beef bouillon seasoning, I'm gonna add in water. But you can use a uh, beef stock or a turkey stock or a chicken stock. If you're gonna use bouillon, use water. But if you're not gonna use bouillon, just use the stock. We're coming along, we're coming along. This smells so delicious. I wish this screen will scratch and smell and you can see how delicious and lovely this smells. Look at those vibrant colors. This is gonna be so good. I cannot wait to eat. Go ahead and add your lid for about 10 to 15 minutes and then I remove the lid and allow it to cook without the lid. And here you have it guys, it is so delicious. Ground turkey and veggies. Oh my gosh, um, let me go ahead and set this up. I cooked me a pot of white rice. I'm gonna make me a nice plate full with some homemade lemonade. Maybe, uh, uh, you know what? I'll just make me a plate of this, have me a glass of water, and I'm good to go. Here you have it, guys. When I tell you this thing is good, this thing is good. <laughs> I'll see y'all next time. I'm gonna eat. But don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more great cooking videos. Bye.